it's Deidre it's Lenny 3 here and today I'm going to do my craft area tour. So I've been wanting to do this video for such a long time but I just haven't had a actual situated craft area and I finally made it workable and actually like redesigned it I guess you could say and I put it in a brand new location and I'm really happy with it. So I hope that you guys enjoy and let's get started. So first of all my craft area is in my closet and this is just an overview of it. Um, so, basically on this side I just keep my shirts and then random stuff over there. And then all over here is my craft area, so I just have stuff down there, my desk, that cork board, and then I just have a bunch of stuff down here. And, yeah, so, let's get started. So, first I'm going to start down here. So this is just a little tin that has random ornaments on it, and I keep all of my scrap fabric in here, and as you guys can see, I have a lot um, so it's just all in there, and then I just have my cutting board for my polymer clay because um, it like sticks to my surface, so I use um, that cutting board. So here's my desk, and I don't know where my desk is from. I really have to clean it up, obviously, but yeah, that's just what it looks like. And then my chair is an ottoman from Target, and it's just black, so yeah. So on top of my desk, right over here, I have this, which is a little drawer system sort of thing and this is from Target so on top of it I just keep polymer clay charms I have to glaze so yeah so in this first drawer I have a bunch of my charms that are too big to fit in my charm box and then I have broken charms and I keep all of the broken pieces back there so yeah that's that drawer then in this next drawer this is kind of not opening but um in here I just keep like random stationary stuff so I have like a piece of foam in this little envelope thingy that I have nothing to do with and then I just have like some stickers um some tape some scrap paper stuff like that so I just keep that all in there and then in this last drawer I have these paper clips that I use for glazing my charms and I keep them in this baggie and then I have um this eyeshadow that I use this eyeshadow palette that I use for shading charms I have my glaze and I have two tubes of super glue for um fixing my broken charms so that's that, and then right over here I have this cup, which is just like a regular paper cup, and I use this um, for when I paint, I put the water in there so I could like um, put my brush in the water, so yeah. So um, in here I just keep all my paint brushes and my clay tools I don't use barely ever, except for my, um, my wire cutters, I don't know why they're in there, but um, these tools I don't really use too often, so I just keep them in there. So right here I have probably my favorite part of my desk. This is where all my acrylic paints are and I basically just have them color coded because I'm weird like that. So yeah, I just have them all there. And then right over here I have these four little containers. So I have this which is actually a candle lid. And in here I keep these little like hook thingies that I got from Lowe's today and I don't really know what to use them for. So I just keep them in there um, because if I never like, if I ever need them for something I just have them there. And then here I just have this, which is actually a little candle jar, but I, like, took the wax out of it when I was done with it. And in here I keep paper clips, tacks, and yeah, so that's just in there. And then right over here I have this little bucket sort of thing, and in here I keep my hot glue gun and my glue sticks. And then this is just, like, this random little glass container, and in here I keep all of my, like, pencils, pens, markers, um crayon stuff. I have this big crayon down here and a sharpener. So that's pretty much the top of my desk. So inside of this drawer I have a bunch of little organizers and this one got stuck. Anyways, so this is um, where I keep all of my clay stuff and it's all in this box. I actually have a video on this. It's my Palmer clay organization video. And, um, basically, I do clay in my living room because me and my dad can't really do clay at this tiny desk, so I just have all the stuff in there, so if I'm, like, want to do clay, I could just bring this whole thing instead of having to, like, go everywhere in my desk just to get, like, a block of clay and some tools and stuff, so I just keep that there. And then right here I have this little organizer, and inside of here I have a bunch of random stuff, to be honest. So over here I have, like, gems, I have these really cool little pin things. They have, like, adhesive on the back. And then I have this random sewing thingy. I don't really know what that is. I have, um, these little random buttons. I have a bunch of bobbins. 
these little like foam sticky things, which I don't know what to use for. And then I just have empty bobbins here, and I have these little note cards. So, yeah, that's what's in there. And then in this organizer here, I keep all of my polymer clay charms. So, yeah, I basically just have them all in there. And I do have a collection video, and I'm trying to do an update video for you guys. I will do an updated one. Um, another charm update soon. Just to let you guys know that. So that's what's in that drawer. And then over here I have this, which is a little, like, um, container sort of thing. And it keeps all of my open blocks of clay, and I keep them in these baggies. So I just have them all in there. And then back here, um, let me try to take this out. I have my video notebook, which actually just fell over, so I keep that in there. And then I have my clay machine, which um, is my pasta machine. And I just keep that, that back there because I didn't want to, like, waste space on my desk for that. So, yeah, and I bring both of those things down when I do my clay in my living room. So I just keep those in there for easy access. And then right over here, I have all of my polymer clay. No, what am I talking about? Polymer clay. All of my fabric that I've used recently, so I keep it there. And then I have my sewing machine, my pincushion, and a bunch of rulers. So that is that. And then right up there, I have this random mirror. I have a bunch of hangers right there, so I apologize about that. But I just have this mirror. Hey, guys. Well, you can't even see me. <laughs> Anyways. Yeah, so I just keep that there because I have nowhere to put it in my room. So, yeah. And then down here, I have a bunch of stuff. So first of all, this is going to be hard to show you guys, but in this container, um, it's like a pencil box. Don't judge me. This is from like third grade. Um, in here, I keep all of my craft um, yarn, whatever this is, um, craft floss. Yeah. Um, so I just keep it in there and I just have a bunch because I used to make like friendship bracelets. So I just keep that there. Then I have that big pad of paper. I have a random clipboard right here. Um, can't really get this in here. Okay. So I have a random clipboard. I have that poster that's, like, really old. It's like a Miley Cyrus poster when she was actually, like, normal. And then I have another clipboard right there. And um, a bunch of my scrapbooking paper over there that I'm going to use for videos. Um, so I just keep it all there. And I have this grass paper from when I um, made my doll backyard sort of thing. And then that's just a shoebox filled with a bunch of, like, shipping tape and ribbon, so I just keep that there. And then I have my Sculpey Clay Machine box. I have that little container, tin container, that just keeps a bunch of my clay. Not clay, oh my god, everything is clay in my life. Um, that's just a little felt crafts that are from, like, American Girl, and you can get them from Michael, so I just keep all this stuff in there. And then I have that little random little pouch thingy that I have nothing in right now. So, yeah, and then right up here on this hook, I just keep, um, oopsies, I almost dropped my iPod. That would not be good, but I just have, um, my hand sanitizer here because I'm a semi-germ freak, so I just keep that there. So, yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!